Hey guys, so if you've seen my first video on the top dropshipping apps to use in 2019, right? So this is the second part. Okay, so for the third app that I want to talk about today, it's Mixed. Um, mixed with MXED and it's also one of, uh, one of the cooler dropshipping sites. Um, this is a fairly new dropshipping app. And it's one of the most exciting ones uh, I've seen this year. So a lot of entrepreneurs are interested in sourcing li licensed pop culture merchandise, right? Like Star Wars products, Harry Potter products, even Marvel or even Pokemon, right? But sourcing and selling these products legally can be very, very hard to do because of the licensing and stuff like that. Um, but one of the mix is actually has actually partnered with one of the leading suppliers of uh, licensed pop culture merch uh, in the USA. Um, so and mix also enables entrepreneurs to actually drop ship these products. Uh, they are completely licensed and it's completely legal. You won't run into any legal issues when using mixed and. These products have proven to be very, very high in demand. You know, you've seen the Marvel movies, you've seen the Pokemon franchise, it's crazy. So, and there's a huge market for these products. So, if you're interested in dropshipping these products, you should definitely check, check them out, okay? So, they have three pricing tiers, if I remember correctly. Uh, the first one starts free, uh, like Oberlo. You can upload a total of 10 products and you can process up to 20 orders a month. Um, the next tier would be the pro tier which costs 49 US dollars a month and you can upload up to 250 products and fulfill up to 500 orders per month which is already very significant if you ask me. And then there is the expert tier which costs 99 US dollars a month which allows you to upload 500 products and again, unlimited orders per month and you get early access to new features. Um, you can have um, team accounts where you can invite your team members to manage your Mixed app and also messaging capabilities uh, within Mixed. Um, personally, I don't think that's very useful but like it's a good point to note as well. So. It's very clear that the advantages of uh, the Mix app is actually, you know, you, you don't have to go through the hassle of getting the license to actually sell these pop culture merchandises legally. Mix app takes care of that for you. Um, you don't have to infringe on any registered trademarks or copyrights. And they have a growing selection of inventory from a lot of popular movies, TV series, and even video games. And these products have proven to be already in very, very high demand. And there's already a vetted market for customers. So it's a proven market. All you have to do is market it, build your own concept store, and then bring it to market. Uh, like all dropshipping apps, there's no shipping, no fulfillment, or no logistics required. They take care of that for you. And pricing is automatically updated and inventory is also automatically updated so that you never ever run into overselling issues. It's very tightly integrated with the mixed backend, so you don't have to worry about that. Um, so the disadvantage for mixed app again is that it only integrates with the Shopify platform, uh, which is why I always say that Shopify is the best dropshipping platform out there and you should build your dropshipping business on Shopify. Um, so, another advantage that I can think of when using the Mix app, I'm sorry, disadvantage uh, of using the Mix app is the products are only available through dropshipping. You cannot buy them wholesale because of licensing issues and you, can also, you, cannot, you also cannot ask them to uh, help you manufacture OEM uh, goods. Um, the next app that I would like to talk about is actually Modelist. 
Uh, Monolist is also a fairly new app um, and it actually provides a very, very wide selection of ready-made products from independent brands around the globe. The products to sell on Monolist includes like men and women's apparel, shoes, bags, bridal wear, children's clothing, plus size fashion, beauty, accessories. They have a huge selection of branded goods um, and they have thousands and thousands of products to choose from. And again, it also integrates directly with uh, your Shopify store and you can add the products with just one click. It's even easier to use and overload if you ask me. And they also help you manage orders, track inventory, pricing changes. They're all updated accordingly. However, like it doesn't have a free plan unlike some of the un, uh, unlike the dropshipping apps that I previously talked about. Um, they, but they do offer a 14-day free trial for you to go in and dabble around with it. Um, after that, it starts with uh, there's a mem there's a membership monthly membership fee that costs 35 US dollars a month, and it includes all the features, real-time data feeds where. Uh, you don't ever have to worry about overselling. Um, you get access to all their product images, product descriptions, and pricing. But in terms of product descriptions, I think you should actually, from an SEO's perspective, you should always try to customize them based on your brand, your retail store brand. Um, it also integrates... Uh, very tightly with Shopify, so it, like, that's a huge advantage. Um, and the beauty is that no minimum orders or anything like that. If you buy one, if your customers buy a piece, they ship a piece for you, right? So, like all dropshipping apps, there's no upfront inventory cost, there's no minimum orders. And also, um, for select brands, they also offer free shipping worldwide, which is a very distinct advantage here when it comes to drop shipping apps. Um, all products also come, all shipments also come with order tracking and you get to communicate um, and Modelist also communicates directly with these independent brands that are on the Modelist platform. So you don't have to worry about fake products. All of it are genuine and authentic. So you can build like a very strong, reputable brand with Modelist. <clears throat> so, you know, using Modelist also gives you the advantage of working with hundreds of brands but easily managing all of them on a single dashboard, okay? <clears throat> so, there are some disadvantages just when it comes to using this app. Um, when customers make an order on the site, this process is actually not entirely automated, unfortunately, but you will be notified uh, through Modelist and they can start preparing the item to be shipped. But before they ship the item, you will have to purchase it, uh, the pro you have to purchase the product on Modelist yourself. So it's not completely automated like Printful and stuff like that. You have to place the order yourself. And so this might be a bit time consuming when that and takes a bit of time away from actually marketing your service. So if this is a concern from you, uh, if this is a concern, you should stay away from Modelist. Um, and because it's actually in independently fulfilled from the different brands that are Modelist, the shipping times and costs will actually vary from brand to brand. So you might not be able to give like a seamless one-stop shopping experience that your customers might be looking for. Um, and another disadvantage is that to use Modelist, you have to tie yourself down for one year. It's a one-year contract. You can pay either by monthly installments or upfront in, uh, for the whole year. <clears throat> and the, you also don't have the the control over pricing when it comes to Modelist because uh, the margins are fixed. 
like you have to pay the brand 60% of each product's MSRP and your margin is fixed at 40% of the product price, okay? So I hope that is clear. And the next app that I want to talk about is actually Kite. It's also another, it's very similar to Printful. It works very similarly. Um, but this one, for Kite, their product offerings are a little bit different from Printful. They also have apparel, which is a very popular print-on-demand industry. Phone and tablet cases, towels, even flip-flops. They also have photo books, greeting cards, invitations, stickers, and wall arts, and more. And they don't actually own or manage the inventory themselves. They simply partner directly with the companies that manufacture, print, and fulfill the orders so that you get the faster service and your customers get their products very, very quickly. Um, Kite starts free. There is no membership payments or any fees at all. They only charge the user when the customers makes an order. So there are no minimum orders once again and they print on demand just like Printful. So it's a free app. Some of the advantages of using the Kite app is that there are no minimum orders. It's free to use. They offer worldwide shipping and they have a huge selection of products. You can check out the link down below. Uh, it's also a print on demand service. Uh, so there's, there shouldn't be any inventory issues, but and they drop ship directly to your customers. And you can also uh, view your sales reports and sales directly inside the Kite app. Um, but the disadvantages of using the Kite app, again, um, the products are sourced from different suppliers uh, within their vicinity. So there may be some disjointed or slow shipping times for customers when they combine a lot of different products together. And they only offer track shipping for some products, not all of them, and only on an opt-in basis. So you have to pay a bit extra to get, uh, your customers have to pay a bit extra to get tracked with tracked airmail.